Hello friends, welcome to my page, Managing Diabetics. What is the truth about type 2 diabetics? What is the truth about type 2 diabetics? Type 2 diabetics is a serious and prevalent disease, but numerous might surrounding these conditions. Diabetes causes blood sugar levels to become too high and it damages the body. In some cases, it can be fatal. Now, there are two popular types of diabetics. We have the type 1 diabetics and we have the type 2 diabetics. Type, two, type 1 diabetes is the body's immune system attack the cells that produces the insulin. Okay? The body's immune system attack the cells that produces the insulin so that it doesn't produce enough insulin. So in other words, type 1 diabetes is a production of production. Uh, uh, it has to do with the production of insulin. So when the body is unable to produce enough insulin due to the attack by the body's immune system, it produces less insulin than the body requires to regulate the amount of sugar levels in your bloodstreams. So in other words, we could refer type 1 diabetes as an autoimmune disease and also it has to do with production. Now, type 2 diabetics, okay, Type 2 diabetes, the body is resistant to the actions of insulin and fails to produce sufficient amount of these hormones to compensate the amount of sugar in the bloodstreams. In other words, it has to do with the function. So type 2 diabetes deal with function. When the body cannot use the excess hormone, the insulin that the body produces, to correct or to compensate the amount of sugar levels in your bloodstreams. So in other words, we could refer type 1 diabetes as a that has to do with the production of insulin. It does not produce enough insulin that your body requires to regulate the amount of sugar levels in your bloodstreams. Now, type 2 diabetes have to do with uh, your body cannot use the excess insulin that your body produces to correct uh, the amount of glucose in your bloodstreams. So that is why we have type 1 diabetes and type 2 diabetes. Type 1 is an autoimmune disease. Type 2 is a metabolic disease. Now, there are other types of diabetics, okay? We have the gestational diabetics, which may only affect pregnant women and usually resolves itself after birth. Those ones are gestational diabetics. And we have the pre-diabetics, which is the borderline diabetics. Now, what are the causes of type 2 diabetics? Type 2 diabetes could be hereditary, it could be due to that lifestyle changes, and it could be due to environmental factors. These three things can cause you to have type 2 diabetes. And when we talk about hereditary, we're talking about having diabetes in your lineage. Either your father has a diabetes, your mother has a diabetes, or one of your uncle has a diabetes, or your grandpa, your grandma have a diabetes. So it's something that is in the lineage of the family that, that we'll call it hereditary. Something you inherit from your family. Now, lifestyle changes can also be cause of your type 2 diabetes due to the kinds of lifestyle you've been living. Okay, the kinds of food you eat, the kinds of drinks you take, okay, that can cause you to have type 2 diabetics. Okay, so that means you are eating a, a lot of sugary items, sugary food, sugary drinks, taking too much carbohydrate, your food are not balanced, those are, you are not active, you are not exercising, and then you are gaining weight. Those are lifestyle that can cause you to have type 2 diabetics. Then we have environmental factors. Environmental also factor also plays a vital role for you to have type 2 diabetes in terms of the environment where you live, the kinds of area where you work can also contribute to you to develop type 2 diabetes. So friends, these are the things that can cause you to have type 2 diabetes. When you eat too much of sugary items can cause you to have type 2 diabetes. Now, is diabetes a serious condition? Yes, it's a serious condition. If not treated or taken seriously, you can have the complications that accompany diabetes. Diabetics is just, an, is just a one word, but there are complications that derive from the, the diabetes. So that is why you see that what you should be scared of is the complications and not the diabetes itself. If you don't want to lose your eyesight, don't allow yourself to have retinopathy. Okay, if you have uncontrolled diabetes, uncontrolled sugar level, it can lead you to have what we call retinopathy, diabetic retinopathy, whereby the nerves of you, the nerves that are connected to your retina are all damaged that can lead you to have pressure or total blindness. The same thing have to do with diabetes when you have neuropathy, other peripheral neuropathy, 
that occurs you to have nerve damages and blood vessels around those areas completely damaged and that can lead to an amputation if you have any ulcers or any wounds in those areas okay and also you can have eld erectile dysfunctions if you're not controlling your diabetes that can lead to have a nerve damage that control your sex organs okay so these are certain things that can cause a serious conditions if you have uncontrolled diabetes like heart disease stroke high blood pressure kidney disease liver disease tooth and gum problems and skin problems can also emanate due to uncontrolled diabetics so if you're not controlling your sugar levels this as well the complication that can occur and can be fatal at times if it lingers for a longer period of times so getting treatment and making effective lifestyle changes to achieve good blood sugar control can reduce the risk of, com of these complications however they are still possible apparently in the long term so friends if you are dealing with diabetics or you are living with diabetics okay make sure okay that diabetes is a serious condition it's a, it's a serious condition it's an incurable disease it has no cure but can you live and manage diabetes and live a normal life yes it is possible but you have to obey the rules and regulation governing diabetics diabetes has languages diabetes have norms that you have to respect diabetes is governed by rules that you have to live by and if you deviate from those rules and regulations, if you deviate from those norms governing diabetics, then you are avoiding those complications to come that might be harmful to your head and even fatal. So the truth about type 2 diabetes is that one, it is hereditary. It could be due to lifestyle changes. It could be due to environmental factors. Is it very dangerous to your health? Yes. If it is not treated, if it is not managed properly, it is dangerous to your head and can be fatal. All right. Can you live with it for the rest of your life? Yes, it's a long-term illness. This is, but you can, you can live with it for a longer period of time if you handle it properly and live a normal life. So friends, if you are living with diabetes or you are a caregiver to someone living with diabetes, the truth about type 2 diabetes is that, that yes, it's a hereditary illness. It's a metabolic illness. Okay, it's something that you can live with. It is treatable but cannot be cured. Can you send it into remission? Yes. But once you send type 2 diabetes into remission, does not mean it has been cured. You are still a diabetic. The only thing is that now your diabetes is under control. So friends, these are some of the truth about type 2 diabetes. So do not be deceived. There is no cure for diabetes. There is no way you can cure it. Can it be sent into remission? Yes. Can it be sent to reversible? Yes. But re remission, reverse, does not mean it has been cured. It can never be cured. You are still a diabetic. So you have to understand the truth and don't be deceived that there is a medication for diabetes that can cure it permanently. No, you cannot cure it permanently. Once you have an issue with your pancreas, either in producing less insulin or overproduction of insulin, the only way is to manage it properly and to adhere to your doctor's instructions and, to, and then change your lifestyles and then eat a healthy life balanced diet. Exercise is very important, taking your medications and reducing your weight and avoid sugary drinks and then learn how to count your carbs. It is very very important so friends if you like this video give me a thumbs up and then share to your friends keep watching i'm going to see you guys in my next video bye bye